Hello guys, me Carl Santos, aka Happy Carl 95, and breaking news already, and as I do all the time, I present all the latest Kyle Larson and Chase Elliott news out there for the NASCAR Cup Series, so let's read this Facebook post that I believe Eric S. Deep replied to, or asked one of the employees at a Hendrick so let's begin so there was a post that was given by a one of the Hendrick Motorsports people and it's from Conrad McDonald so he he re types in Kyle Larson could get some sponsorship from Cincinnati Incorporated in a few races, so it's undisclosed of how many, but at least he'll get some sponsorship for the beginning of the season, so. And then it goes on and says, Valvoline and mostly HendrickCars.com will fill out the, vo the spot unless a big-time sponsor will get Larson, which, you know... They need some sponsorship funding for later in the summer or in the into the playoffs. So it's still bad news, bad news, but not as bad as you think because Kyle Larson recently won the Chili Bowl, you know, for the second straight year. So I guess Cincinnati and well, I already said Cincinnati Incorporated tools will. Sponsor him not because he won the chili bowl for two years, but second straight year it doesn't hurt so, so One of the employees from Cincinnati Incorporated tools Afu Walden says that he's an employee and been asking around and one of the CEOs of the company is more likely to cater to Larson services and actually sponsor him in a few races in the five cars so. and this is the good news the boss might say that that they're looking to design a paint scheme that Kyle Larson solid color combination so yeah and that's about it so I think it was from a Twitter website from Eric X Deep's account. So if you guys follow him, he'll put up a video up to later today as far as his research is concerned. So I think he's one of a few social media journalists trying to dig in to the truth of Kyle Larson's year for 2021 and his sponsorship woes. But at least it's going to in the right direction, so Okay So As you I'm gonna upload this to YouTube, but my thumbnail for that post is gonna have all the sponsors in the top left corner That'll sponsor him probably for the first quarter of the season and then along the line, they're going to try to help him get them funding. And then as long as Larson gets a few top fives and top tens and lock himself into the playoffs early, and no matter what, I mean, Bristol Derb, it's going to be that race where he must win in order to gain that sponsorship. So... So that's about it. This is around a five minute video. So if you guys want to hear more about the Kyle Larson sponsorship from Cincinnati Incorporated Tools, you got to watch Eric S. Deep's YouTube video at around 3, 3 yes, I believe, 3 o'clock. So I make it Apricot on 5 and y'all have a great day and peace out.